please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please pause for 30 seconds of silence. Good morning, Grizzlies. This is Hector. Chris with Sports News. And I'm Lily with GNN, your Grizzly News Network. Today is Monday, March 18th, 2019. Hey, Grizzlies. Prom is coming soon. Here's more information. Tickets go on sale April 1st. <laughs> Do you want to see some amazing art? Do you wish you could view a beautiful photo or vase on campus? Well, come join us for the second annual <laughs> 2019 art show at Spring Valley High School. Spring Valley's art departments has selected the best sculpture, photography, drawing, and digital art for, the, for a one-week exhibit. The art show will be held in the library from March 25th through March 29th. Teachers, you may schedule to take your cl classes to the library with Ms. Bechtel, and students, you may visit the display before school, during nutrition break, and after school. Hope to see you there. Hey, have you bought your yearbook? Hey Grizzlies, yearbook students have been taking pictures of classes, at assemblies, and during sports. Robert Burns, did you know we have a picture of you on page 37? And that's not the only one. You are in the book 10 times, but you haven't bought your yearbook yet. There's still time. You can get your yearbook at the banker or jostens.com for $90. Get it now before the price goes up again. Now here's Chris with our sports news. Thank you, Hector. A couple weeks ago, the cross-country team held a ceremony called Honor and Remember. Here's more information. On Friday, March 1st, cross-country had an annual Honor and Remember flag ceremony for fallen soldiers. We are recognizing those families who uh, have a family member who's given the ultimate sacrifice for our freedom. You hear freedom is not always free. It absolutely isn't. Thousands and thousands of Americans have died for our freedom that we enjoy every day. They gave out flags to Tech Sergeant Michael Perry and First Sergeant Carol's and Sign's family to honor their selfless sacrifice for our country. To all fallen soldiers, thank you for your service. Congratulations to the Grizzly track and field team for their first meet of the season and a win for both men's and women's team. The men's defeated Desert Oasis by a score of 94 to 75. Women's team outscored Desert Oasis with a score of 110 to 82. Multiple athletes earned regional qualification marks at the Grizzly meet. The Grizzlies take on Bishop Gorman tomorrow at Bishop Gorman at 3.30. Excellent job by the Grizzlies swim team for their win over Secta at Pavilion Pool on Saturday. Boys 186 and girls 96. Uh, 96 and 154 to 119. Highlights include first in the 200 IM by Zhang Shen, 100 free by Logan Brennan, first place in the 200 free relay with Luke Nicholas, Robert Hag, Phoenix Dante, and Colton Ratliff. First place in the 200 IM by Matilda Rodriguez, Rod 
Degari 50 free and 100 backstroke by Chloe Pert, 100 free and 100 back Ali Jacobson, and first place in both the 200 medley relay and the 400 free relay. Special thanks to Mr. Stack, Miss Murray, and Miss Jinx for their help and support. Today, volleyball has a game against Vista at Vista, varsity at 6 and JV at 5. Now here's Lily with some more news around campus. Thanks, Chris. Attention juniors, if you have not submitted your pink open period applications for next year's reduced schedule, please turn it in by Friday, March 22nd. Please submit the completed form to your counselor, Ms. Bennion and Ms. Pearson in room 908. Hi Grizzlies, are you interested in helping improve the local environment? Do you need community service hours? Do you want to show your school spirit by directly making Spring Valley a better place? Join us for the Environmental Club's annual spring cleaning campus cleanup on Thursday, March 21st. We will meet in Miss Banano's room at 9.23 after lunch. Hope to see you there. Parents and students from all grade levels are invited to attend an informational session about college planning. <laughs> college representatives from <laughs> UNR, UNLV, CSN, and Nevada State will present information on scholarships, admissions, applications, FAFSA, important deadlines, and academic planning. <laughs> Junior Jumpstart Night will be Wednesday, March 20th from 6.30 to 7.30 in room 200. The College of Southern Nevada will be on campus on March 26th. This will be an informational presentation. Please sign up in the College Career <laughs> Military Presentation. <laughs> Remind or stop by and see Ms. Julie in the College and Career Center, room 402. Another round of CERT testing will occur in April. Here's more information and some of the questions you will see on the tests. Attention juniors, UNLV will be visiting our campus on March 21st, a Thursday, to present to all those juniors who are interested in attending UNLV after graduation. Please sign up on the Remind by st stop by room 402, the College and Career Center, and let Ms. Julie know. Now here's Andre with the weather. Thank you. So today's actually been a really nice day, just like the past few days, with some really nice weather, especially with high about 75 degrees and a low about 49 degrees. It's going to be sunny throughout the full day with a little bit of clouds, but that shouldn't matter too much because there's going to be a 0% chance of rain throughout the day, and there's going to be 48% humidity. So for those of you outside, you're not going to feel that that much, but you are going to feel it. In other news, there's going to be some really high temperatures coming up in the next few days, but we should be fine, especially as in the next few months, the temperatures should be about higher than average in northern Nevada, but in southern Nevada where we live, it should be colder than average. Now the reason for that is that in the past months of like January and February, there were really cold temperatures that almost broke the records. So with all of that, back to you. Thank you, Andre. This was Lily, Chris, and I'm Hector of GNN Your Grizzly News Network. Have, Have a, a marvelous, marvelous Monday, Monday Grizzlies! Grizzlies.